Tuesday the 25th of July. Court report, well, court report is, I can't say anything. So I'm under oath. And during this period, till I finish giving evidence, I'm not allowed to talk, I'm not allowed to talk to anyone about the court case I haven't, you know. I, there was so much stuff going on anyway that I could talk about. I can't talk to my lawyers, I can't talk to anyone about it. Well, I can talk to my lawyers as long as I give, they, the same email gets sent also to the opposition, the prosecution lawyers, so it's just, it's fair, everyone knows what's happening. And that's great, you know, I think that's normal, and I want to, maintain that it is a completely surreal experience it is however much you prepare for standing to take the stand having someone heavily cross-question you is you know it's an interesting experience clearly I can't go into it and <clears throat> clearly I spent you know I had to make certain I was really there with it it was three weeks I haven't taken three weeks off work since I started working in this you know I, I, I cut twice so I've taken two weeks off and that's it you know so three weeks off was incredible and I had to be absolutely on my game I was a hundred percent on my game so I really really was caught in at that spot and doing the whole legal thing then of course now I'm back in the clinic and I've got to be 100% on my game in the clinic. There is no, you know, there's no paint by pictures or simple textbook telling me what to do in all of these different situations because clearly I'm taking on some of the more difficult cases. And it's, you have to be on 100% of your game and to swap from being legal to being clinical and still absolutely 100% on the game. That's, whoa, um, you know, as I said, I, I don't think I'm a depressive person, but whoa, I've got enough things to make me depressive going on. It's, it is hard work and to stick to the straight and narrow through all of this. And then I'm moving at the weekend. If life wasn't hard enough, that's just another thing I'm doing. So I just wanna say, we are gonna be focusing more on the YouTube channel and getting information out here. I know the court case has kind of taken up the dominant time on the channel recently, but I wanna get back into doing more interesting, useful things. Clearly the Mewing app is out now. And as soon as I feel a bit more happy with the way it is, we'll be um, covering that and you know going into some of the exercises I give on that. And we also are gonna to want to start building a community. So we want to make a movement. If we're gonna make a movement, I want to engage with people. And we're looking for people to give a hand. So not just yet, but if you would like to help with this movement, gaining change, literally changing the world, this area in the world of healthcare, then watch this space because we're gonna be asking for volunteers and people to get more involved in all of this. And then finally, on Monday the 31st, this coming Monday, just you know, six days from now, we're gonna have another Patreon Q&A. So that will be 5 p.m. UK on Monday, the 31st of July. I love to have people there. You know, we do want to convert people onto Patreon because that does help. You know, that gets us going. Listen, thank you very much. Thank you very much for taking the time to get to this point of the video. I think we're doing well. We will have to see.